Hi guys, Jared O'Neill here. Uh, Will Castle Dagger in. Just doing a short video here on a hand painted kitchen. Um, basically, on this job, I'm not doing the whole kitchen. Um, this was a new built house, and uh, the architect basically uh, done everything himself from start to finish. Uh, the customer, who I previously worked for in her old house, um, wasn't happy with the colour scheme uh, in the kitchen. So basically what we're doing at the minute is the island. She wasn't happy with the island. She wanted a lot darker. And it just clashed with the, the colour in the rest of the kitchen. So um, basically what I've done is I've cleaned it down with um, a degreaser. Uh, I've taken a couple of doors off. Uh, I've primed it with uh, Prime 2 color trend epoxy which is a great primer it really does bond to the surface but i certainly wouldn't recommend working with it if you are a d no diyr as in do your own stuff because I, even myself an experienced decorator it's very very hard stuff to work with anyway so i, I cleaned it all down give it a light sand and put the primer on i have now put the first coat of gray on it uh, it's called Wolf Grey Colour Trend and the customer wants it darker. So it'll do for a base coat. So what's the stage I'm at on this here? Um, so just let you have a wee look at it here. So where you go? As you can see, there's a door off there, there's a door off there. So this is our wee island here. Go around to the side. Nice granite work top there, you know. The colour scheme was very bad for this kitchen. It all should have been dark because the work top's quite light. Uh, those three drawers there, one, two, three, or four. Uh, I'm doing those first and then I can pop those out and do the small edges. And I'll just show you here. You have a wee edge in here. So we need to take the drawers out to do that. And then you have this wee side here. But to get another two coats. And then there we go, there's a shelf out and the two doors. So there you go. And just stand back and let you see the end there. So basically what I have to do is when I get the darker colour, I'll do a wee sample on putting two coats on that you see uh, how to go about doing this here. Uh, as I say, it has been primed and it has been first coated. It has to get another two coats of finish. We're also, I have Gary upstairs, we're also doing a bedroom, an ensuite, and the downstair Lou over here on the left hand side. We're redoing that as well. The colour is skimming stone on the walls, fire on ball, white on the ceiling, and antique cream on the woodwork. And again, I'll show you that there as well. So, any questions here, by all means, get back. Thanks a lot now. Bye.